Access to appropriate sanitation facilities is an essential requirement and right of human beings. Approximately 2.3 billion people across the globe lack basic sanitation facilities, along with 892 million people practicing open defecation. Since after the 2015 conference of UN, where SDG defined its 17 goals, many countries have taken the issue of clean water and sanitation quite seriously. Deprived sanitation system causes death of 1.5 million children annually. Over 2 billion people live in water-stressed countries. Globally, at least 2 billion people use a drinking water source contaminated with feces. Microbiologically contaminated drinking water can transmit diseases such as diarrhea, dysentery, typhoid, and even polio, and it is estimated to cause 4 lakh 85 thousand diarrheal deaths in each year. Pakistan has made significant progress in improving access to sanitation, yet 25 million people still practice open defecation. Lack of access to proper sanitation facilities negatively impacts the health and well-being of children. 53,000 Pakistani children under the age of 5 die annually from diarrhea due to poor water and sanitation. An estimated 70% of households still drink bacterially contaminated water. The KP government launched a public toilet finder mobile application in 2019. Although a step in the right direction, the application did not address the unhygienic conditions. Jawed Anjum, a resident of the city, while talking to the Express Tribune, informed, "No one uses these restrooms due to unsanitary conditions. The government does not spend a penny on repairing or making these toilets usable." Towards the northeast of Lahore, some 380 kilometers away, The federal capital and its twin Rawalpindi offer a joint total of only 27 public latrines. The twin cities women shoppers forced to use men's restrooms. Express Tribune states the door latches are missing. The walls have telephone numbers written by disgruntled lovers and other men note these down to harass the women over the phone.